can't imagine it'll be for long, although he does have four fouls, so that'll be the one wild card in how Coach Witherspoon uses his senior leader. Depend on the next two minutes. I'm sure he'll be back in the game another minute and a half, two minutes. Crawford spinning and winning right to the bucket. <laughs> Tip in this one, Iona, the seventh seed in the home whites. Kanisha is the tenth seed in the look there in the mid range from about 16 feet, just too hard off the back iron. He played so strong earlier in the year, getting a lot of buzz for potential Mac rookie of the year. Crawford, the step back, so strong the left for the season. Great look down low and missing the bunny in close is Corey Brown. So He's had some great opportunities from the free throw line and under the basket, but can't hit. Yeah, he really has. That's point blank range. You have to put that away as uh, Crawford with a nice Crawford. Uh, this team, they, you just alluded to it, Greg. They started two for ten, but they're just so talented on the offensive end. They'll start to shoot the basketball better. Ben Perez has come on off the bench for the Gales. Here's Crawford down low. Clean catch and draws a throw from New Rochelle. All Mac first team selection. championships in a row. I mean, just amazing when you think about that. That's so rare. He's only one of fifth playoff. And that's the patience of a veteran. The shot clock winding down. He wasn't rushed. Found Henderson right as time was expiring. Yeah, he is so much experienced by Malik Johnson. He really makes this team run. Crawford pulling his way down low. And then he holds up the... was about five feet behind. about 26 feet shot it to over the basket even Steph Curry thought he should move in <laughs> Crawford now answering yeah that and in great interior defense Fritz has time for three and cannot connect that's not his game necessarily Yako Fritz yeah a handful of threes on the year right I think uh, Iona would uh, is fine with having Fritz uh, shoot that uh, from beyond the arc and he's just looking for a call as Crawford was able to step through on that dribble drive. Now takes it on the backdoor catch. Boy, that is just a great high low. The lead. That was a good look by Brandon from distance. Washington can't answer. Crawford battling in close field. And then Iona. And free throws is where the Gales have been able to keep pace. Eight for eight now from the stripe. Crawford, hard drive, and draws a foul. This conference that is a problem every night because he shows you the ability to hit from the outside. Yeah, but he doesn't get enough credit for his post-up ability. He can post on the low block. He can post in the mid-post with the big three ball. We're under eight to go now. Crawford inside, can't hit in close, and then he's fouled on the second effort. Johnson and Jelani White coming over. I didn't like that foul call, but... Uh, Crawford just puts, as he knocks down the first free, multifaceted on the offensive end. You know, he can beat you from distance, mid-range, and his post-up game, and he can go off the beat for long, although he does have four fouls, so that'll be the one wild card in how Coach Witherspoon uses his senior leader. Depend on the next two minutes. I'm sure he'll be back in the game another minute and a half, two minutes. Crawford spinning and winning right to the <laughs> bucket for Iona. Tawana A.G. has fouled out. E.J. Crawford carrying four fouls. Crawford looking to draw a foul. He does exactly that. Veteran. Terrific tonight from the charity strike. 93% so far. And Crawford adds to that. Coach Kloos has not been with the team this season, but still in touch with the team. Yeah, they're going to be a tough out. 25 seconds left to foul. And Crawford has bumped in more free. Crawford continues. Follows through underneath the basketball. Perfect backspin. That was about five feet behind. About 26 feet. Shot it to over the basket. Even Steph Curry thought he should move in. <laughs> Crawford now answering. Yeah, that's...